Hi, let's solve next previous question of compiler introduction chapter. This question was asked in GATE CS 2018 question number 8. It is asking which of the following statement is false. Let's analyze one by one statement. First statement, context free grammar can be used to specify both lexical and syntax rule. Lexical analysis use the regular expression and regular expression can be represented by context free grammar as regular language is subset of context free. For all context free grammar, you cannot write regular expression, but for regular expression, you can write context free grammar as regular language is subset of context free grammar. And we know syntax analysis that uses context free grammar for parse tree. Now, lexical analysis can use the context free grammar. Syntax analysis already use context free grammar. So, both lexical and syntax rule can use the context free grammar. So, statement one is true. Next, option B. Type checking is done before parsing. No, type checking is done in semantic analysis and semantic analysis is after parsing. Syntax analysis that is parsing, semantic analysis will do the type checking. So type checking will be done after parsing. Here it is written before parsing, that's why it will be false. So statement B is false. Next option C. High level language program can be translated into different intermediate representation. This is true. There are different intermediate representation. Three address code is the most popular, but there is quadruple postfix notation. So option C is true. Next option D argument to a function can be passed using the program stack. This is true. Program stack holds the activation record of the function called which store function parameter, return value, return address, etc. So argument to a function can be passed using program stack. This is true. We found option A is true, option C is true, option D is true. Only option false is option B. So answer will be B. Type checking is done before parsing. This is false. Type checking is done after parsing. If this video is helpful for you, please like and subscribe. Thank you.